How's everyone doing today? You guys excited to see the main event? My name is James Hobson, and I go by the Hacksmith Online. I'm an engineer, and I build things that mostly you just see in movies, comic books, and video games. We have a series on our YouTube channel called Make It Real, where we try and make real working prototypes of fictional items. Back in November, I actually quit my full-time job to focus on YouTube and backyard engineering full-time. And this is the very first live exposition that we've gone to to show off the exoskeleton. The exoskeleton we've been working on for a few months now. It's loosely based off the game Call of Duty. It's electrically powered with a lithium polymer battery and has an air compressor which charges the tank here. The pneumatic cylinders are what allows me to lift the DeLorean. The DeLorean, by the way, weighs 3,500 pounds. A lot more than most regular cars because it has the unibody design and stainless steel side panels. Previously, we've lifted a Mini Cooper and a truck. So the DeLorean is actually heavier than the truck because we're lifting it from the rear end, which is where the engine is. So most of the weight's on the back end of this vehicle. It's estimated we're picking up about 1,500 pounds with the exoskeleton. And if you don't believe me, we're going to ask for some volunteers to try and pick it up without an exoskeleton. If you have back problems, please do not volunteer. Guy in the plaid shirt? Let's start with two people, see how that goes. Yeah, a good stretch would be good. Nope. <laughs> All right, can we get two more big guys? Almost. All right, let's get two more people to join these two. All right, let's see this. Oh, a few millimeters, come on, a bit higher. Oh, nice work, guys. All right, I know we have some wrestlers in the crowd, some pretty big guys. Do you guys want to give it a try? Let's give him a countdown. Three, two, one. Whoa! Good job, guys. I'm afraid not. All right. So, I don't know if you guys are watching, but did you see how much the steel was bending under the weight of the car? That is structural steel, two beams with another piece inside, and it still bends. So, I'm going to suit up, it takes me about a minute or two, and then you'll see me, by myself, pick up the, ex the uh, DeLorean with the exoskeleton. So while James is getting suited up, and uh, we're going to find out if with his mind he can pick up what four professional wrestlers pick up. He's wearing a tactical vest that's actually attached into the frame of the armor, the exoskeleton, pardon me. Do we have any kids in the audience who would like to sit in the passenger seat? Right there. There we go. That's my part done. On the sides, the, the bands in there, what they're going to do is take the weight of the actual exoskeleton off of his body and hold it onto the legs themselves which allows him to sit locked into it comfortably for longer periods of time. It would allow him to work uh, bent down, halfway, squatting, anywhere along the ways for uh, any amount of time that he needs to, putting all the weight from his body onto the exoskeleton. So how are you feeling? Not too bad, I'm ready to lift this car. All right, well, here we go. Paxman's gonna get into place. The locking pins on the weldment frame. Are going to allow him, sorry, going to allow him to pick up the car again. All right, can we get a countdown? Three, Three two, two, one. Lift. Here it goes, here it goes. Checking tax 
steps while he's lifting the car. <laughs> Four professional wrestlers are the mind of the hacksmith. I'm going to pass it back over to the Hacksmith. Yeah. All right, how's that? So this is just the beginning for the exoskeleton. We've been working on it for a few months, and we're not even anywhere close to being done. Next step is powering the upper body, so I can also lift things with my arms. We document the entire build process on our YouTube channel. There's already over 20 videos outlining how we built this. Now, with a little of engineering know-how, you could make your own. We're even planning on doing a power loader from the Aliens movie. And that would be able to flip the car, not just pick it up. <laughs> I'm the Hacksmith, and thanks for watching. www.thehacksmith.ca There's links to our YouTube, or you can just search the Hacksmith online. You'll find me. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed the expo. I'm here with one of my fans who's been with the channel since the original Elysium lift. This is Boglin. And it's a special sign of appreciation for coming out and seeing us. Give me a set of bad ratings. Thank you. No problem. Keep on watching. I appreciate it. Good luck with the expo. Thank you.